Guys, welcome to Division 2. I got to play the game at E3. I'm still at E3 in my hotel room, bringing you guys the goods. I've still got plenty more goods down the line. True Suns have this area locked down, but if you can capture their control point, you'll be clearing the way for the settlement to take it over. Yep, emotes are in this game, in case you guys are wondering. Yep. <laughs> so this area's been taken over. We're gonna try and clear this area, get the right people in place, the good people, of this world. This is Washington DC. As you can tell, it's 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 not looking particularly that great. This is set seven months after the last game. A game which had so much potential and so many really, really good ideas. And it's, it's still an absolute, I love the game. Like, honestly, I really like it. But the end game was a little bit shaky. There's no end game stuff in this, but I'm, I'm hopeful after playing this. I am very, very hopeful. As you can tell already, the, the graphics look definitely a step a, a notable step up for me anyway like i it just looks a lot better i was playing i believe what was i playing on i think it might be pc actually yeah i was about to say xbox one x but i don't think it was i think it was pc it comes out in march next year so it's still a way off still a way off they have a hostage have a flash boom yeah, so he was over the intercoms. I was like, you guys ready? Ready to go? This is, um, I believe, one developer playing with us and two like other sort of press YouTubers, who I didn't know, but um, we jumped in and we kicked butt. Yeah, this is like our second attempt. We was pretty bad in the first one. I was definitely uh, division rusty. I'm not going to lie. Like, till here, I'm still a little bit like, I'm getting a little bit too far forward. I'm getting absolutely wrecked. Um, in this game, I don't think it was in the last game, I don't remember anyway, so you can repair your armor and Yeah, so you can repair it if you get, if you get damage you can sort of retreat and you get like weapon like repair kits or sorry armor repair kits that are dropped Which is uh, useful. So you just press I think it's like uh, Might be right on the d-pad. Just hold it down repair back off and go back into the action uh, I tried to pick up as much loot as possible so you guys can see the loot we picked up all the loot I saw was a um, like a better option. So I don't know if this is like mid game or the start of the game. I think I saw like rucksacks, weapons were all better than what we had currently equipped. This scenario is really cool. I just love the environment. Like it looks so, so good. Like even the grass, if you walk over it, it flattens. This is so many fine details in this world. It must have taken so much time to put together. It's, yeah, absolute gorgeous game. You can sort of like walk on the grass, flatten it. It's just like, wow. And that is my drone. The drones are back in this game. You have um, you have specialists, you've got specialist weapons as well. I don't think I got to use mine. I couldn't find special ammo. Apparently there was some in the game, but I never, I could never see it. That was a shot. That was a good shot. Yeah, also I'm the marksman, so I'm gonna hang back, uh, provide support, try and suppress the enemy, and just try and do those headshots. <laughs> That's the name of the game. Roly pole is everywhere. It's one of those games I would really. If I can get a couple of friends, maybe. And do a car up, like four player car up, that'd be the pinnacle. The pinnacle. I want to try and do that. I do, I do, do, more, I do want to do more collabs and stuff on YouTube, but that's, that's for another day. I will discuss that later. Ooh! Yeah, so that gun is a random gun. I was like, what is that? It's like a weird, like. I don't know what, it, what film does it remind me of? That's a flubber, it's not a flubber, it's something else. So it's like a weird foam, so it, it it freezes you in place if they get too close. And it's just like this weird liquid just like splattering at you. And it sort of like foams up and you just can't move. <laughs> and you, I think your friends can help you out so you can ask for help and they sort of shoot you, which sounds really weird. But it, it gets rid of the the, the material, the, the, the weird liquid that's around you, freezing you in place. What's that? That is arm. Some arm armor. Every element of the armor, it's all back. It's, I believe, exactly the same as the last game in terms of like what you can equip. I'm guessing there'd be many, many more options. Look at that plane. Oof. You're closing on the control point. I'm seeing multiple hostiles. Pick your spot and plan. Backpack. You don't want to just rush into this. This must be quite late on. If it's level 30, it must be. It's got to be, surely. Also, you must start at level one, I'm guessing. 
I was like, what is that? I thought it was a target on the floor. So this is the, the big scenario of the demo. This takes, I guess, five minutes to take them all down. Like, you just keep coming and coming and coming. What I like, though, is you can call for, like, reinforcements, which is quite a nice little touch. So you can go, please, anyone around, back up, back up. And they just bring, like, general survivors. Not, like, division agents, of course, but they bring back up. They help you out. And, yeah, that's nice. I guess if you build that relationship, you can get better. You can get more backup. Yeah, call cool for nearby allies. There is a lot of action in front of us. Yeah, we got. I, I, I'm going to be honest. I in the first try, I fell over, like dropped once. We had people dropping all over the place. But I think we've done a pretty good run on this. I can see why they said like plan first <laughs> and then record. <laughs> it's a, it's, a, it's a little bit. Yeah, it's been a while since we played Division. I'm not going to lie. Great shooting, Scott. Yep, superb. Some moments I'm like, whoa, that was a good shot. And some of them I'm like, that was shakalakin. That was terrible. That's a flare. Flare, so we call for backup. Allied reinforcements are inbound. Just a little bit more numbers, a little bit more sort of distractions. That guy's trying to flank us. I, what I did, actually getting quite pressed by, the enemy is always trying to flank, trying to move. In the first playthrough, I keep speaking about the first playthrough, but they kept moving around me. I was just surrounded and I was like, I give up. <laughs> I'm so dead right now. There's nothing I can do. I repaired my armor. I had full health, but they were just surrounding me. I was like, I was by myself. I went too far forward and got swamped. Absolutely swamped. There's a sniper up there. Oh, the big dudes arrived. Who can take so many hits. Tips for this guy is obviously aim for the weak spots on his back and also try and flash bang him, throw grenades at him, just try and do as much damage as quick as possible. Otherwise, he really starts to just damage you a lot. It's, the guns just seem to just keep firing and firing and firing. It does not stop. Yes, yeah, so one of the other classes, I believe, is like a grenade launcher, explosive expert, which I'm quite jealous of. That was the developer. I need some backup now! Yeah, they're struggling. Ha ha ha! They cannot the hand. They couldn't handle the division agents. I'm too good for you. Man, this guy's getting absolutely millions. Millions! Oh, there we go. We come. I got the final blow there. I'm gonna take all the credit anyway. Screw you! I'm excited to see this Washington D DC. Obviously, it was set. The first game was set in New York. I a lot of people didn't like it, but I really, really enjoyed the setting of the first game. So I'm hoping this is again like a step up. We've seen a very small portion of the world. Um, I did pick up. I'm not sure I picked up yet. So my screen's really small. I'm not gonna lie. I'm, I'm recording this on a very small Mac, and I can really not see the screen right now. But we picked up a shotgun at one point. Yeah, there we go. I did pick up a shotgun. Obviously, it's very close range, but it just the spread just always hits them. Yeah, eat that! It didn't quite work as planned. I probably should have stuck with the rifle. But... Yeah. I want to see some different guns so you guys can see not just me using the marksman rifle. Oh, there's the goo! Oh, it's like someone's just throwing up in your face. I did get stuck. I got st stuck briefly. I think you can shake as well. And your allies can shoot you. Which sounds so weird to say. That's true. So that's a weird mechanic, like the fact that it's just like this goo that just like confuses you in place. I'm like, oh my god, I feel so vulnerable right now. I feel so weak. And weak. So this is what they're trying to go for. How we doing? We good? Is everyone still alive? I'm use this pleasant, comfy sofa as my protection. Yeah, if you guys are excited for Division 2, please let me know. I think then, yeah, please come to this. It's a place to come for something. I think it was. Yeah, I think it's time for, for a beta. I'm just going to play the beta. I'm going to play the whole game. I love Division 1. I'm not, I know everyone didn't like it. Didn't, they didn't love it. Um, but it's one of those games which came out and they built quite a good sort of uh, platform, basically. So they, they gradually upgraded it, made, made things better. And it was a really good game at the end. I'm guessing they've learned a lot. And yeah, I'm really excited to see what they can do. Really excited. It's one of those games where I was like, this game has some really cool ideas. Perhaps the second game will be a lot better. Almost like what Assassin's Creed done. Like Assassin's Creed, the first game, a lot of people still like it, of course, but some terrible aiming. 
Sight is, is captured. It is ours. Yay, the good guys have it. Woo! Taking that control point out of action is going to make a huge difference for the settlement. They needed this. That backpack must... That looks heavy. <laughs> it's like some, the new backpack we got during this, this demo. Um, we're going to explore the plane a little bit. You can go up in the plane, get a good like vantage point if you want to. I was just on like the ground Toxic level, but complete up to you. And yeah, guys, that's pretty much the end of the demo. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you guys want to see more Division, let me know. Leave your comments, leave your likes. Thank you to Ubisoft for letting me capture the game and give you guys my impressions. Obviously, it's quite a small amount that I played. Uh, but yeah, it's potentially looking very, very good. So I'm excited. See you guys soon, and... Bye-bye.